hello there, YouTube. Welcome to a 22 degree morning here in Toledo. The, uh, the guy was out here at 7 o'clock this morning looking at the old Jeep. And uh, he bought it. He's going to come by here tomorrow. It's got a transmission issue, so that's why it's just been sitting here forever. And, um, anyway, the guy's gonna buy it. I don't know if he's got a, a transmission. It's not like you haven't seen me all day. But, uh, anyway. Um, I don't know if he has a transmission for it or what, but, um, we, uh, got the thing, uh, or my son got the thing running this morning. I was talking about things that haven't run in a while. Got the other thing fired up and running, and that guy bought it. So it's going to be something different with today's vlog. <laughs> Pardon my, my being bundled up. It's colder than, than holy heck out here. But uh, today, on today's vlog, whatever I vlog today, it's all 100% going to be on a uh, 128 gig iPhone 6s plus I don't know why that's hard for me to say 6 plus is easy 6s plus just makes me think about it every time but whatever I film today is going to be with with the iPhone I, I'm gonna do a review oh, look at the ice on the um, guardrail I don't have my glasses on, so I can tell if it's actually focusing on that. But, uh, I was trying to get the little, see the little bird roaming around in the bush up there. <laughs> anyway, I've, I'll do a review and stuff on it, but I have a, a cool little handle for it and a zoom mic that's specifically for iOS devices um, I want to say it's the Zoom RX7 I may be incorrect on that I uh, just opened it and played around with uh, the mic gained and stuff like that to see to see where it should be it's Sophie out there something is out on it now besides the mysterious disappearing battery I asked him about that again this morning and he goes I'm telling you I did not take that battery he goes you need to talk to Christian Ashland's boyfriend so, <laughs> who knows it's been so long since the uh, the truck was driven nobody knows but it, it I mean it, two things obviously wasn't stolen and if you came in here one you'd have to get past all the dogs and uh two why would you steal a battery of an old 77 toyota pickup truck and that was most likely dead anyway but these old bird houses were out here well before we bought the place and some of them have fallen down some of them are about to fall down and, they're falling. and the crazy thing is the the birds still make nests in them every year. This one, I'm thinking probably not, because the internals are already coming apart on that one. And there's even a little nest up on the on top of the, the old clothes hanger. And this one looks like the roof is the roof has gone off of that one, so I'm guessing that one is probably not being used anymore either. Look at the, I don't know if you can make that out, but the cobwebs that have uh, ice on them. That's pretty cool. I ever seen you guys go a little workshop out here? These are all molds for making ceramics. I hope she uses these things. Because what I, I fear is it's just going to be a load of very heavy stuff that we're going to have to figure out how to dispose of someday. Where's that 
radio. You can hear that thing out here sometimes at night when you're out and about. You're like, what the hell? But this is Kelly's little workshop. You can tell she's, uh, during the wintertime, it becomes a storage shop. But she's got all her all her little crafty things out here. And it's got a little little loft up above for storage. <laughs> I hung that picture up there. I thought, let me see that thing. I'll show you what to do with it. It was a picture of my oldest boy Kyle. I always loved that picture. And I, and I hung it up there. He was still living here at the time when I hung it up there. He loved that thing. I guess I could turn the light on here. There's, you know, like a thing for working with stones. And this is a, a really old, there's the drum that rides on top of these two rails. Got a little electric motor stuff there. It's a polisher. And then our little saws and, and whatnot. <laughs> little Christmassy things back there. And our little crafts. Little refrigerator. She's probably even got cokes and stuff up there. We had a little microwave out here, and a, and a heater. I don't. The little heater. I can't figure out what happened to it. We can't can't find it. But uh, as you can see, the walls aren't insulated. But when you come out here, this little electric heater. It was just a little small boxy heater. We fired that thing up. So if you want, you can get left in there. Out. Nope. Come on, so. Come on, you crippled up old dog. There you are. I'm going to end this thing for you. Yeah, I'm going to suck it up. I'm going to go up over here and check out the horses again. It always amazes me how horses, cattle, and stuff like that are, are unfazed by, uh, by the cold. You would think that, uh, watch these little finches that get out here. They steal the little scraps of, of the pieces of horse food that the horses drop. But anyway, this, uh, iPhone setup, I'll, I'll show you guys how I got it set up. I'll probably do a little review on the, on what I'm, what I'm using here. Sophie, you scared the birds away. I was bird watching. But uh, anyway, I'm going to go inside and uh, they might get me a cup of coffee. And I haven't posted any videos today. I usually do them at night. I was so tired last night when I got home that uh, I signed off, meaning me personally. I woke up at 12 minutes to 5 this morning in my desk chair. And the craziest thing is, I, I felt I feel like I got 10 hours worth of sleep. I said, chair is so comfortable. It's weird you can sit upright and sleep that good. I woke up because the pit bull come in and was announcing to me that he needed to go out. It was potty time, so that's what woke me up. And then uh, me trying to, because he gets all excited once he realizes I'm going to take him out. And then... Kelly had all the, had the sisters and the mama, had all the dogs in the house last night. You should have seen them. They're all kind of laid out in a circle around the, the pellet stove, you know. You tough? But anyway, him scuffling around woke Kelly up. What do you hear out there? What's going on? You all puppy. Bust out some water. What do you think, tough, huh? Are you water trough shy? Trust me, this horse is shy of nothing. <laughs> I just couldn't imagine drinking that that cold water. And the way they just I mean funnel it in. It, it's 
excuse me. <laughs> Suck it in. I like to get, get Kelly in there as much as I can. Poor thing, she had to work today. My son drove up here. He says, yeah, the roads are pretty icy. But we got, got good tires on the old element. And she's all-wheel drive. Well, she's all-wheel drive as soon as the front slip. But it happens so seamless and instantly. It, it's like it's all-wheel drive. So uh, we'll chit-chat with you guys later. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day. We'll see ya. Pitch black dark out here. Kelly just got home. God, this camera does not pick up low light. All right, I need to open this door, so I'm gonna stop. So how's he gonna get get the Jeep? That ought to set the dogs off. Over here, hold it. Oh my god, how many of those things did you grab, woman? Four. Alright. The pack mule lives. I said, woman, pick that bag of stove pellets up and pack that shit inside. Okay. Right now. Can you hand me that one? Yeah, I'll, I'll take it in. Well, they don't practice so, practice. how'd your day at work go? Very dusty, very long. It was a good day. Uh, they sound all stuffy. She's doing inventory and all them inventory things are full of, <laughs> drawers are full of dust. Years of dust. Yep, so years and years and then the body shop adds insult to injury. Okay, well, in we'll say bye to everybody. Bye everybody, sorry. The one happy. night I'm going to have a talk with you and you're bailing on me. I'm sorry. Alright. Gotta go. Alright, see ya. Bye. Pack mule. Tried to hold. You can't stop that one. She's non-stop go, go, go. So, uh, <laughs> that'll be today's video. <laughs> I thought I was going to have a chat with her for a second. And uh, our house is dark. We Too dark for filming with this. And even with all the lights on, it's too dark. So Anyway, maybe I'll have to change that. It's winter time. Put some different lights in there so it'll brighten it up. But uh, we like it that way, nice and comfortable, just comfortable. Go in some people's houses, like, yeah, need sunglasses on. Oh, check out my new lights. And like, yeah, you could set stuff on fire in here, you know. But anyway, sorry, just mostly me goofing around today. But we're off together tomorrow, so uh, we'll come up with something. So sorry for the lackluster video today <laughs> anyway, so some days you're just gonna have days like today <laughs> so we'll talk to you later now thank you very much for watching take care bye bye